I got Melody on the line. This is Rock Child, the Red Shield. Stop, stop at the Sabbath. Do what you do. You know what I'm saying? Being real. They want us to be religious and spooky. I don't think so. You know what I'm saying? We gangsters for real. We people in the street. You know, 24/7. You know, uh, I got Melody. I think she's coming out of New York. What's up, Melody? Hi. Hey, what's going on? What's going on in your life today? I mean, you got anything to say? I mean, basically. The last thing I did, I was talking about strap-ons. You know anything about that? No. Okay. That's I cool. like dick. You like dick. <laughs> okay. So how you like your dick? Uh, short, stubby, long, what, fat, skinny, hard? I like it to fit. I like it to fit and hard. You like it to fit and hard. Okay. Okay. So what is your idea of a perfect night? Like, you know, perfect night, you know, date, dinner, lunch, um, what, you know, I'm saying, what, I, what I'm saying is I'm asking you this because people don't know how to get along with the, with the opposite sex. Right now, it's cats, uh, cats against the dogs. The opposite don't get along with each other. There ain't no people. It's just the opposite sex just don't get along with people, with each other for a simple fact. Men are dogs. Women are Angels. Women are angels and men are dogs. Okay, that's that's I love I love that. That's I mean, and this this and it, you're right. I mean, you're 100 percent. When you say it, that's it. That's what it is. That's what it is. That's what it do. You know. Okay, but w how how would we try to correct this? Or you think it's it's okay like it is? Okay, something. You got these men out here. Just like women. Nobody's better. Nobody's perfect. You got men, because you're talking about sex. And in the world, it's, it's all about sex. Everything is sex is in the world. The videos, the clothes, the mind, people hormones, <laughs> everything. I look at it like this. you talking about scrap on. Some women love dick like I do. I put it to them like this. Yeah. Yeah. So, my thing is, what did you ask me again? No, you said, you, were, you said, uh, you was asking you what's the solution or how we can have a harmoniously where everybody's, everybody's happy. Do you think it's past the... Married men, mm -hmm. single men, all men, they take a woman body and they look at it in so many ways. You take, for example, you got a married man. He got a, a wife at home. Mm -hmm. Okay. He outside. He with his boys. He chilling. He see something. He married now. Committed. But he still want to fuck that. Mm. Then you got... The single man, that's just all over the place. That's fucking everything. Mm. So sometimes, we women get tired of it. The ones that got these men cheating on us. We got this one. And that, um, popping up for the... Um, as far as dick, some women get tired of it. And they turn the scrap on. They say it's better than a dick. I wouldn't know. I'd rather the real thing. Even though men the, the, the bottom of the pit. In my book. Um, so what do you think about pussy? You could ask me about scrap on and dick. Well, I think it's a comforting thing. I think is I think right now men is trying to go back up in the womb because they're afraid to fight the battle of uh, freedom, justice, and equality, and and love and truth and happiness. I think, you know, they they, I think they a lot of people right now is just I think they want that, but they don't want to take it and respect it and protect it. And learn how to keep it safe with mobility of the laws and things of that nature. I just be taking it to another level, you know. But yeah, I mean, I I like it. I like it. I like what you're doing to me when you do what you do, baby. I mean, that's like 
that's like the natural the natural comfort zone you know what i'm saying but um i i i i don't think i don't think that you know women is playing fair because they're they're using batteries and toys and stuff like that and um that's really hurting them and it's separating them okay. you say women is not playing fair but is these men out here playing fair no so you can't call and be against the dildos and the scrap and all that when men is not fair when people are not fair women are not fair because they cheat on their husbands too they out there doing dirt Right, right, right. I got you. I got you. I mean, you're absolutely right for what you're saying. You know, but I, I say, I mean, when, maybe one day we can all go back to the natural way of doing what we need to do, you know, and skip. There's no natural way no more. It will never be back a natural way. It's no way because the more and more and more is getting worse with sex. Like, I, like, for example, me and a friend of mine actually was just talking about something the other night. And they were like, saying, you got good pussy? They asked me if I think I have good pussy. I said, well, I've been told. And from what I know, and from what I have worked this pussy, I, I, I'm quite sure I'm going to say my shit is good. I'm not going to put it down. So... What's the difference from good pussy and no good pussy? Since you all in the sex thing, you know. Well, I think I think the good I think the uh, the good snatch, you know, because when I say pussy, you say pussy. Okay, yeah. When I say the good snatch, the snatch, the catcher, you know, the love maker, the baby maker, I think it's good no. when when. No, it, let me tell you something. What? Let me ask you. Let me ask you this. When a man says he has good pussy, right? Yeah. And say for me, he got pussy. He got a choice of four pussies. And out of all them four pussies, maybe one of them is good. The, the one of them is the best, and the other three is just, you know, regular pussy. And ain't giving his dick that snap he really wants. But yeah, and all, how, what, you as a man now, how do you handle that situation? Hear what I just said. You got four pussies, you got four pussies, you fucking. Okay. Out of all them four pussy, only one of them is good, right? The other three doesn't give you a dick to snack that it wants. Mm -hmm. You still fuck the other three. But you don't fuck the good pussy. So, what's the problem, man? I mean, you're giving me the answer and the, the situation at the same time. It's nothing for me to say, but you're right. You know, uh, people... I think people need to be fair on, you know, on the snatch. You know what I'm saying? And I think that... You didn't answer my question. <laughs> I didn't answer the question because you didn't give me no room to answer the question. I mean, it's like... Uh... I asked you. I asked you. Okay. Let me let me break it down for you a little bit less of them since that may be too much for you. Yeah, too you much got for two my pussies. rent. So. You got two pussies, right? Two pussy cats. Go ahead. Can we say pussy cat? This is something. Yeah. Me and my homeboy just been done with him. He just had a baby with his baby mother, right? Mm hmm. And he's fucking his girl. So he asked me, he said, Melody, you know, mm -hmm. he want to try to work it out with his baby mother. But also, they both were cheating in the relationship. Right? Right. So. He's trying to ask me, what should he do? Like, his baby mother just had a baby, maybe two weeks ago, right? Now, you know she can't have sex for another, what, six weeks, so that's how it go. Right. And then he got the girl, the, the side chick, whatever you want to call her. Now he's trying to stay away from the side chick and try to work things out with the baby mother who just had the baby. But yet and all, he want to fuck. Mm -hmm. Yet and all, he don't want to go back in that direction of the the, the, the mistress, whatever you want to call her. Mm -hmm. So what would you do as a man? He said because even though she had the baby, doesn't mean that he don't want to stop messing with the side chick. Okay, I, so I, be you, I believe that nature, you know, don't okay. wait for, nature don't wait for nothing. I think the rules to the game is not 
with nature because nature is going to make a woman do what she want to do when she want to do how she want to do and it's going to make a man do what he want to do how he want to do and this has already been seen we already see in this you know with people's conduct so i think that people should get with nature and don't get they get their feelings hurt when other people are doing other things i think people should do what they want to do okay so in that case you saying he should fuck both of them, continue to fuck both of them. I don't know. You're I, not saying that. No, we say, we're talking about one conversation from one point of view. You never know what the girls is doing, too. They may not be uh, all that, uh, you know, like, uh, dedicated, you know. Women women is very sneaky, like the cat. That's why we call y'all the cats. And y'all, oh, cl really? y'all clean, yeah, y'all clean up behind yourselves very, very well. They used to have a saying, oh, they say, mama's baby, daddy's maybe. Mama's baby, daddy's maybe. You know, and this has been going on for a long time, you know. I just think that, um, you know about that, right? Mm -hmm. Anyway, we're going to continue this because we ain't got that much time on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? This is Rashiel, the rapper, talking to Melody out of New York about uh the situation of life we're talking street talk street talk coming at you street talk